would make the flight a lot more fun, wouldn't it? I for, think so. For a nervous flyer like me? Yes. In tonight's <laughs> Eye on Entertainment, LL Cool J and Chris O'Donnell are meeting fans in Hollywood. And CBS2 Entertainment reporter Suzanne Marquez is live in Hollywood at Paley Fest. Hey, Suzanne. Hey, Pat and Rick. That's right, in the middle of Hollywood Boulevard right now. But across the street is where we're going to be in just a few minutes at the Dolby Theater, the site of Paley Fest, actually named after the founder of CBS, William S. Paley. It's a big week bringing together fans with some of their favorite shows. And the cast and crew of NCIS Los Angeles is here tonight. LL Cool J, Chris O'Donnell, Linda Hunt, Eric Christian Olsen, Daniela Rua, Barrett Foa, and Renee Felice Smith will all be here tonight with executive producers of the show for a special screening and panel discussion followed by Q&A with the audience. You can catch the show on Sundays at 8 p.m. Disney is being sued over its Oscar-winning animated film Zootopia. Gary L. Goldman, a screenwriter and producer whose credits include Total Recall and Minority Report, says the studio copied the ideas he pitched to Disney in 2000 and 2009. His lawsuit includes drawing he commissioned his on top in this picture and Zootopia's on the bottom. Goldman says his idea explored life in America through a civilized society of animals, and he's asking a federal judge to block Disney from future Zootopia. Projects until the case is resolved. Dave Chappelle fans on the East Coast probably didn't sleep much last night. The comedian's Netflix special dropped at midnight, West Coast time, which meant those in the Eastern time zone had to wait until 3 a.m. to see the special. And one fan summed it up best uh, Netflix, if you think I'm staying up until 3 a.m. for this Dave Chappelle special, you're absolutely right. Now, the lineup for FYF Fest has been revealed, and it's looking pretty good. Now, Missy Elliott is set to play her first U.S. concert since 2008. It's also her only scheduled performance for this year. The last time we saw her on stage was 2015 as Katy Perry's special guest during an incredible Super Bowl halftime show. Beyonce may have bowed out of Coachella, but her sister Solange has been tapped to perform at AFYFS. She won a Grammy for Best R&B Performance for Cranes in the Sky at last year. Grammys this year, just a couple months ago. Here are the headliners for the weekend. Friday, July 21st, Missy Elliott and Bjork. Saturday, Frank Ocean. And on Sunday, Nine Inch Nails, Bjork and a tribe called Quest will also perform, along with a couple dozen other performers, but we don't have but time for all of them on the air. So head over to CBSLA.com and we'll have the complete list there. Back to you, Pat and Rick.